happen. Yes. Yes. Oh, thank God. Yes. Oh, I've been so patient waiting on these birds to come in. Oh, I belly crawled out, set this primo uh, strut and tom an hour and a half ago. I've been super patient waiting on these two birds or, or toms. They've been down in this corner for two hours or more. I was another 100 yards, 200 yards up over the hill. And, uh, oh my gosh. Oh, I wanted this to happen so bad today. John and I hunted yesterday, and uh, we were close. We had birds around us a couple times, and we were really close. It just didn't quite happen. Uh, but John, hey, made it happen this, today. It's about uh, 11 o'clock. I just text Nell. Uh, I miss her. Um, we uh, were at graduation at the University of Iowa for Tyler yesterday, and I wanted to be out here hunting, but uh, uh, it paid off today. Sunday, May 17th or 18th. No, it's uh, May 11th or 12th. Let me look. I'm pumped. I'm so excited. Oh. I called. They gobbled. Uh, they were strutting back and forth in this field earlier today. Early this morning, I had a gobbler right behind me at probably 40 yards, and I think he saw me move. I waited, 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 and I was calling, and uh, I think I spooked him. I, I waited and uh, as long as I could. And then I turned around to see if he was there and uh, I think I blew it. I think, he, I think he was there and I think he saw me and he took off. But he answered back to my calling two or three times and he kept moving in closer and closer. And uh, John and I had shots at Jake's yesterday and um, I really wanted a Tom and I got two this morning. So uh, a year ago, John and I both got, well, John and I, uh, a year ago, John and I were together hunting near this same field, and uh, we shot two last year on the same day, and uh, really nice toms. These both look pretty good. They both had pretty decent beards, but, uh, well, let's go check them out. Um, I'm just elated. I'm, I'm ecstatic. I just, I am so excited. Uh, that all this came together this morning. I'm just, I'm pumped that everything happened pretty good. I'm done by noon and uh, I made it happen. Um, I wish John was here because it's really fun hunting with him. His calling is awesome and uh, it's fun to move through the woods with him and, and uh, find the birds and get closer to them. And, but uh, I'm glad to be here today and, and glad again that, that I made it happen. It was a really good morning, great weather, and I just sat calm, and I thought, gosh, even though they're down there, and they're moving away from me, they're moved closer, I uh, belly crawled out, put my tom out a little further. I wanted to get him out further, obviously, but uh, I didn't want to spook him, but uh, I belly crawled, set him up, about 45 minutes, an hour later, I belly crawled back out, and I set him up again, move his tail up and down a little bit. move his tail up, move his fan up and down a little bit. I'd let it sit up and then when I saw these birds coming in, I thought it'd be better, it'd be like uh, him being a little more submissive if he dropped his tail. So I kind of kept him parked like that the whole time. And uh, I had a hen further up the tree line here and uh, was hoping that I could make this happen and uh, I did. So again, I'm really excited. Um, May 15th, and it is 11.30 right now, and uh, made it happen. I'm super excited.